So if you're watching football on Sundays, you're seeing there's not as much pink on the field as there used to be. And that's because the NFL now does crucial catch where before they used to do breast cancer awareness. If you're seeing anyone in high school, peewee, other leagues wearing any pink stuff, it's because the original support of October was breast cancer awareness, as in wearing pink on the field. But the NFL has moved to crucial catch, which basically represents all cancers and pink has a lot smaller role. Having said that, in every league below it, pink is still the primary one because it's the easiest to associate to and the easiest one for companies to make accessories for without getting in trouble with the NFL for using like their crucial catch kind of graphic. So today's video, I'm just gonna quickly talk about all the different accessories you can wear on the field and what you should do alongside that to make sure you're supporting the cause. So number one, if you are supporting the cause, make sure that you are donating. The reality is some companies out there, they do not donate the money they get from anything pink where other companies are really heavy into the donation and stuff. So if you're looking at a couple different companies, make sure the ones you're looking at donate some of the profits towards cancer research. And if they don't, and it's still a company you wanna go with, make sure you are donating yourself. My old team had a rule that if you were gonna wear anything pink, you had to donate to a pool of money collected by the team. And then after we collect all the money, it was donated at the end of the month. All right, let's jump into some of the accessories. All right, so we're gonna start at the head and work our way down. First thing on the inside of your helmet, if you did wanna try, you could pick up like a shiesty. So I don't have any of the pink ones. You could just use a shiesty like this and get one in all pink. Very bold way, but you could wear this on the inside of your helmet if you'd like. Outside of that, one of the really easy ones is gonna be a mouth guard. Mouth guards are cheap. This is a sleeves one here, but again, sleeves did not sponsor this video. So you could just go with like a sleeves lip guard here and you want the lip guard because it gives you the nice big bit of pink. Or if you just have a detachable strap, you could just do the strap as well. Well, yeah, that's a very good look. Outside of that, you can actually buy 3D bumpers now that you can kind of put over top on your helmet. So this is a pink one that would go in the back of Rodell Speedflex. Again, this is sleeves as well. This is new to me. I've never seen anything like this before. So this is actually pretty neat. Outside of that, sometimes the visors you pick up will have pink tabs in the packaging. So make sure to check those out. I think Next Trend has those. Oakley has those. Pretty sure Shock has those as well. Or you could just go with like pink visor clips as well. You can pick those up too. Down from the head, we're going to look at the arms. So for that, there's a couple different things you could probably look at. First one we're going to look at are going to be arm sleeves. So you could go with like something like this or like this, just an arm sleeve that you'd wear in one arm. Do not do both these the left and right. This is just too much. So you can go with something like an arm sleeve if you want something kind of big and bold on here that's really easy to put on and doesn't really get in the way. Outside of arm sleeves, you could also go a little bit more subtle and you could go with something like a wristband or an armband here, some kind of thicker or thinner looks that you can have to these as well. And by the way, most of the stuff, the pink is not gonna show up on camera well. Pink is super hard to show on camera. So it is very pink. It's probably gonna look a little weird on here. Outside of that, kind of the same realm with your shoulder pads could be your back plate. We have a sleeves back plate cover here. This drip is honestly one of my favorite things that we've checked out. It's really subtle. If you are exposing your back plate, this would be a really subtle thing that you could do to check out too. And if you did want, you could obviously go with pink gloves. Only challenge with pink gloves is they're gonna be probably one of the most expensive things you'd pick up. And you can realistically only use them for about a month of the season, which doesn't really get you your value. But again, I'll link some below if you wanna pick some up. Now, the last thing we're gonna look at is legs. And the reason we actually made this video is because a lot of the stuff when we made this video years ago, some of these accessories didn't really exist back then. First one being scrunch socks. Scrunch socks were not around back then. So you didn't have these really long, big pink socks like we do now. These things are massive. You can scrunch these things up. Again, these are sleeves, but you can pick up all these kind of accessories from sleeves, battle sports, next trend, phenom elite. They all do really similar stuff in this world. If you have a pair of game socks that you already really like though, and you just want to go with something over top, you can go with the scrunch sock look, but it's like half a sock. So it doesn't have the actual sock part and just slips over top of your leg. Outside of that, you could also spat your cleats with actual like pink spat and pink tape. But if you don't like that spat feel, not everyone does, you could go with something like a spat cover here. This is basically just a piece of compression material that goes over top of your cleat and over top of your high angle. But yeah, that's going to be it. Tons of different things you can check out. More of the story is make sure if you're going to wear any of this to donate. Again, I'll leave links down below to a bunch of different accessories you can check out for yourself. Hope you guys enjoyed today's impromptu video. I'll see you next time.